Welcome to Delta Waterfowl September Migration Report. I'm Kyle Winterstein, Managing Editor of Delta Waterfowl. Folks, we have made it. What an exciting time of year it is as waterfowl seasons open across North America. So let's keep some tabs on the birds, shall we? We head first to North Dakota for a Central Flyway update from Matt Chenard, Senior Waterfowl Programs Manager for Delta Waterfowl. I wanted to give you a quick migration update for kind of the Central Mississippi Flyway. Things are starting to move along here. Uh, goose seasons are starting in states, if they haven't already. Uh, the early goose seasons, uh, Canada geese. Um, teal seasons will be starting up pretty soon. Uh, the teal are already moving south. We're hearing reports of teal in, in some of the southern states. Those would mostly be the, the male adult uh, blue-wing teal. They migrate first. Probably are already seeing some shovelers and, and pintails as well. So things are start, starting here. Um, should be a, a good start to the duck season. Hope you guys are getting out uh, to chase some geese or some doves or some teal here in a couple weeks. Thanks, Matt. Heading east to the Mississippi Flyway, let's see what Paul Waite, editor and publisher of Delta Waterfowl Magazine, has to report from Wisconsin's Horicon Marsh. The migration is definitely on in the upper parts of the Mississippi Flyway. Uh, today I'm out hunting teal in Horicon Marsh in Wisconsin. It wasn't fast and furious, but we did manage to get a couple of blue wings and also Got a green wing teal too, which tells you that definitely some birds are moving. Um, reports from other people who are hunting fields right now for the early resident goose season, are they're doing quite well, lots of birds, um, and it's only gonna get better from here. Thank you, Paul. Now let's find out what's happening in the Canadian prairies. Here's a report from Jim Fisher, Delta's Director of Conservation Policy, who's based in Manitoba. Up here in Prairie, Canada, we hosted our 18th year of Delta Marsh first hunt event. We had 25 kids out, lots of mentors. We we're in a stubble field here that had great shoot, mallards and pintails, Canada geese, and even a few wood ducks came in today. So good report so far, lots of ducks here today. Uh, Canada geese, cranes are here in numbers. And uh, it's been good across Canada so far from our early reports. Ontario seems like it's gonna be exceptional this year. Thanks, Jim. Here in Pennsylvania, like many mid-Atlantic states, the focus is on resident goose season and we're anticipating a great one. Uh, the Atlantic Flyway resident population is estimated at 933,000 breeding birds and uh, we really had good conditions in the east this year, so I'm anticipating a, a really strong fall flight. The challenge at this point has been finding fields that are, are harvested. Uh, we're seeing uh, a lot of wheat, at least here in Pennsylvania, that's been converted to rye. Uh, it's giving us some access issues, which is why today we're, uh, we've gone to plan B here, hunting over uh, water where we've seen some birds loafing. Probably going to go 0 for 1 today on the season, but it's early. It's only going to get better from here. So folks, have a great season. Be sure to check back at deltawaterfowl.org for more migration reports.